move straight ahead to Sword Art Online. Yes, our weekly bash, baby. Let's go. Weekly, our weekly shun section. Fun this times. Is my favorite show. My favorite uh, show. I'm sure, Shred has plenty of things to say for him today. <laughs> Kick it off, Shred. Kick I it mean, off. I'll, I'll have somebody else start. I, I mean, I didn't write as many things as like uh, I, sh- I should have or could have. I have like just one um, thing, like I want to say, like. I like I really don't care that Eldred died. Like I know they're trying to like redeem him this episode and try to make it all dramatic. I really didn't care. Same. I felt nothing. Dude, like, what? He's <clears> one <throat> of the integrity knights. You're just in a shit open like that, dude. That guy's Even just though a bitch. he did actually jack shit. <laughs> dude, I like how like the like well, the two the, the worst knights like, put together. The thing is that like like he did it because he wanted Alice's attention. It wasn't even it was like barely like a noble act. Like it was just because like he was just it was noble act. He was just, <laughs> he was just being a bitch because he got rejected. That's that's, you that's will why do I... crazy no. things for a woman. At least no. That's if if, if anyone deserved to die, it was the other one, Renly or whatever. Dude, the one that with the kid, yeah. actually that kid. Yeah, that one worse. deserved to die. <laughs> I think I think Eldry actually deserved a chance to survive. And then with the whole like. Uh, like surpassing his limits with the help of Kirito's hand or will or whatever. Yeah, I, I feel like that's kind of cheating, and it would help him cheat enough to actually survive that attack. But Dude, there's been so much of stupidity and like cheating, like in this so-called game, that I'm just like, whatever. Yeah, so many you things are happening that just doesn't make any life. sense. Hey, yeah. it's <laughs> just a game. No, like it's not just like negative life. Like the, the amount of fucking life that that guy went negative was more than I think is even allowed in uh, for having maximum health in a game. <laughs> yeah, it was like just a game. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I know. Yeah, definitely. This, uh, this Listen, creator man, definitely knows his games. games. I, all the games I've ever played. Well, my health bar hit zero. I'm fucking dead. dead. Yeah, they no, I, I, I surpass no limits, no matter how much next, I believe in myself. Next time you play League, Brian, just make sure you go negative health, and you can you can survive. I, I actually, yeah. I'm sure the game will allow it if you will it. Uh huh. Just press R. But, and then, and then if your emotions <laughs> be so strong that you affect the neck, the player uh, right next to you. Well, it's not even that. It's just other just, like stupid shit too, where like they, you know, they sacrifice those three thousand people to make like those worms things, and the, this chick is just like, ah, they can't block this by the, the sword or armor, and yet somehow basically, uh, Eldry like destroys all of them. And uh-huh. it's just like, okay, they, I mean, I, I don't know like how it happened. I don't even know if the creator knows how it happened. I don't think he destroyed. Um, it. I think he just basically just like has. Yeah. Made, made him absorb it. Into, he willed them uh, away. Stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think it was like his <laughs> the whip thing, whatever. It's like his oh, sword awakening or whatever it's called. Dude, those yeah, snakes did nothing, man. Perfect I'm surprised like his so. whole body wasn't like like destroyed. Like how do you like? Because Kirito, OP. Because <laughs> like because you, you assume like his whole body is just like be like burned up, whatever. But only like half of it was. I'm like okay, mm-hmm. bro. Only half of you gets burned when you go like negative a million life. <laughs> yeah, and it's I'll only the top talk. part that that stays intact because yeah. you have to talk like to people that. before you die and confess. Yeah, yeah. And he was that burning too, and he was able to like get his arms out of the burning. It's like all of a sudden it's just like okay, their arms are back. Yeah, good to know. <laughs> you need and to like, have the death speech. And, and like they're also they're just trying again, like trying to make you sympathize with like the dark territory people, of, like with like you know the, the pig people. But I just that. I still can't care about. Dude, that because is again, again, these, these are just AI. No, they're, they're real people. It's just the game, bro. They're real people, man. They have fuck lights or whatever they're called. Yeah. yeah. Doesn't they're, that make them else. real, man? Doesn't that they give have them a soul? Soul. Because, mm-hmm. like, oh, I mean, because the last episode too, like the or what? I forgot was the last episode or this episode where um that one wolf that like got burned by the laser. He was just saying like. You know, those, those those episode. Episode. Those yeah, episode. okay. Yeah, yeah, he was saying that like, like I, <laughs> I need you because like that way our people mm. can go back to grasslands and like live our, you know, our ways. Blah blah. blah. No, fuck y'all. <laughs> yeah, I uh, one one thing I have that is not an ogre to me. <laughs> yeah, I know that's <laughs> when what I was they first said that was an ogre. I was like, bro, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> was it was it ogre or orc? No ogre. Okay, ogre. I was like, yo, in my entire like twenty-two years of existence and however long I've been playing games, not once have I ever encountered an ogre that looked like a werewolf. Okay. Okay. It doesn't even matter. (laughs) But um, no, I, 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 okay, yeah, I noticed that too. I wish I could was listening to the what they were saying in Japanese. I think probably like understood it better, but yeah. I doubt it. Translation. I doubt it. This whole show is lost in translation. <laughs> but, uh, but like, but 
the the ogre and like the, the pig people. Like, yeah, they're trying hard to make us sympathetic, but don't care like, at all about them. Yeah. Really, I really don't because care. I also don't care so about heartless. this. How are you yeah. so heartless? Okay, I also didn't care about like that little conversation they had. Like, oh, we need three thousand people, like you know, willing to give their way their lives. And they showed like two random people that seemed like they had a storyline and <laughs> they didn't follow up on anything. I mean, nope. it's not like I wanted them to waste time on that anyway. So it's, I mean, good on them. But at the same time, it's like, why bring that? Up? Why bring that up anyway? There's no feels there. And then, like, so. and then uh, the cycle chick, you know, she stabs the two other mages just to absorb Bro. their life. I mean, I saw that Bro. coming, honestly. Right. But how much is it going to do, man? It's like you're basically stabbing the people at like the beginner like level area. I mean, what you're gonna power up two level by off of two level ones? Go for it. I mean, it seems to have worked because she didn't technically die yet. We didn't see her death scene, and also the the leader of the the pig people survived too. I think because okay. you didn't see his dead body corpse. All right, sure, man. She she gets two level ups. What's 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 she gonna do? <laughs> I uh, survive, sir. I don't know. Survive for what? Like maybe five minutes of the first episode of the next episode. <laughs> yeah, I'd say so. Oh, I wonder God. if so is the emperor is he actually gonna fight? Or actually I assume that maybe his knight he's gonna be the one fight. I assume they're not gonna make the emperor fight till like later. Yeah, probably. They, I think... they, they gotta see like Alice by then. Oh no, no, I just remembered he saw Alice and then he had that creepy smile and he said Alicia. I was like, oh my god. <laughs> Alicia. Where's give me my, give me so my screwdriver? <laughs> God, <laughs> never mind. Like, he's totally uh, like a fighter. <laughs> uh, I do a fight or uh, something else, David? No, oh, something, something. <laughs> he's got, awesome. he's got a lust for her. Oh god, dude! Oh, there, I, I wish I didn't remember that now. They're like, oh, god. I can't remember the like the last like uh, villain that I could have that I, I didn't care more about than this guy. If that just, makes sense, I don't care at all about this guy. Well, it's just, it's just <laughs> sword. Art. It's just sword art. Like it's just lost its appeal after, after the, um, like the the elf online. Like after both in game and the, the real life villain. Yeah, uh, I don't know. Dude. This, no, no, no. The in, the in game because 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 Gun was the real life one. Yeah, I don't know, man. Like this, like uh, this creator just can't make like good villains. Well, yeah, like like like. Like Elf, Elf online, you know the, the creepy guy who, who kidnapped Asna, and then Gungale, the, the other guy who was like, I know, creep. Know, like the yeah. almost sexually assaulted Shinon. Yep. Well, no, actually, Gungale made sense, and I feel like the very first arc, uh, uh, Elkride or whatever, I cried. Uh, Elkride. Oh yeah, that, first arc, yeah, yeah. That, I feel like those two actually made sense, but what? then the Elf arc and then this arc uh, just makes zero sense. Yeah, well, I mean, the first the first season, like, uh, I mean, like, the, I mean, in a, in a in a way, you could actually, they made the uh, I forgot the guy's name, but they made him somewhat Heath, likable. Heathcliff. Yeah, Heath they, Cliff. yeah, yeah, they kind of made him like somewhat likable. I think they kind of gave him like a you know, it's like causes like why and like what he was doing and stuff. When the, his like, Japanese name was like Kobayashi or Kabayashi, I yeah. can't remember. But it's just like, but all these other villains, though, like, they, there's just nothing to them. It's just basically, it's like you don't sympathize with them. They're just they're just evil to be well, like, like you just like, don't like, care. Good, good villains like they like, um, like you don't like like for good villains like you can see like why they they do the things they do like so even though yeah. like yeah. It, even though it's, it's the wrong method you can see why like they, like why they're doing it yeah yeah but and it's just like it's, this always, guy it's can't always do it it's always the excuse of psychopaths yeah so. yeah but I mean like my two favorite seasons of of Sora was the first one and then I also then uh, Mother's Rosario neither one of them had like technically like villains. <laughs> <laughs> or like bad villains or just yeah. like or just you know villains to be evil yeah. um and then my least my least favorite ones were the ones that that they're just they were just terrible villains i mean the first season in allization didn't even really have i mean they had Pontifex, but she was the ai villain yeah but i mean oh. that but that was better than the other ones i've had <laughs> um, even though it had just a stupid name with the administrator but <clears throat> i don't know uh i felt like it made sense but they, they just didn't um, I didn't think they executed like her story really well at all. Yeah, this guy never does. <laughs> <laughs> there, was really so much, this all, there was so much. There was so much potential. Years. Yeah, yeah. There was a lot of potential. Is, a lot this, of is like, this is like what the tenth anniversary of like the sort of first Sword Art anime. Yeah, um, I don't care. <laughs> but like, but but it's, it's all this time, all these years writing, and just, this is what we get. I know, fantastic, right? 
No, oh, maybe like the guy's just tired. You know, like he didn't expect it to be this popular for so <laughs> long. Okay, and he's now like he's thirty-one just, like, or something. Bro, he gets you're, plenty of energy. I mean, uh, you, like you're saying oh, no, this, basically the guy just got tired after, like, basically after the Iron Crowd. Do you just know like, how oh, like two elves? Do you know how overworked these manga artists or manga writers he's are? Light, novel, he's a light novel yeah, writer. Novel. Bro, that's so much work. <laughs> it's just typing. He's typing. He's not like. <laughs> He's not yes, destroying his hand. He has to come up with ideas. He has to constantly churn out ideas that are good, right? And it has to be up, nah, I mean, up to par with his first uh, first season, which, yeah, by so, the way, it's been good downhill ever since. Yeah. Yeah. So, like, man, you like, know and, and, and that yeah. aspect, it's like, it's really hard. Like, if you start on a super high note, let's say like a 10, right. it's really hard to continue on that, like, good streak of being at 10 like when yeah, you start right. off high it's well, really I mean, it didn't start at 10 but, but it's still like he still yeah. didn't keep it up but i mean it's yeah, really I hard mean, to basically fuck it up that fast too i mean i mean it, you say that fast but it, this, this is what like five six yeah. seasons in that's it's, it's but, been going on no, for a while. It's, it's, i'm talking it's, about the elf one like the elf was so much like it was just like right after that and it basically immediately just I think, okay I you think, are, yeah you're I right think it's because like <laughs> it was, it was, again i think how like sort of started like he wrote a web novel when he was 15 and then and that ended up being his best one somehow. But well, well like he's and then he started Excel World, and then like his his editors found out he wrote Sword Art, and they published that too. So it's like I don't even know if he. So even though like he did write Sword Art, like I don't think he expected to go back to it again. That's why I think that that's why like it's such a weird like transition because he didn't expect to continue writing the series. I he should have. Well, I think he, too. I think he should use that that uh that opportunity just to reboot like his. Instead of which, any Minecraft, which I thought they were going to do. I thought they were going to do it, but I don't know if they're still planning to do that or not. They always hint at it, like about like bringing back like Minecraft, but right. Like, yeah, I mean, never do it. it's going to be so far down the road. I don't think people care. Like, I mean, I don't know, dude. Like, so, like starting out, they've they've gone to like so many different worlds, so many different stories. It's just like, do what you want, man. I don't care about <laughs> like like really. The story is just all over the place. It makes really. It's they have like their own like storylines that just they just seem like like, they like literally all the side characters like no one's not even Asuna's here yet yeah like, it, uh-huh. like nothing is connecting to anything it's just like basically just random like just random stories you might as well have a different fucking cast yeah that's true <clears throat> but by the way if if Vanilla Wow can make it can be a thing I think Vanilla Sword Art can be a thing Brian yeah. Brian you <laughs> what are your thoughts. <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> oh my god! You. See, I, I was don't... expecting something. I was expecting something well, else. They're gonna use no, excuse. Like... They're, they're gonna use excuse of PTSD. No, Just like not, not so. So the thing is, is like it actually applies really well because right now, Sword Art, like according to everybody here, it's complete fucking garbage. In WoW's case, the retail right now is complete <laughs> fucking garbage. But next expansion, point, Brian. Like, when you look back, okay, next expansion time. I'm talking about like currently in retail. Like it's complete fucking garbage, and it completely releases Sword Art because looking back, everybody can agree that literally the first arc of Sword Art was the Ironcrad was literally the best. Right. And like yeah, just thing of like if, if yeah. you talk about like in that sense, like vanilla, wow, vanilla Sword, it it it's perfect. Cause exactly. Yeah. It's, okay, right. it's like it's getting like further away from like what it, what it, like what like how it started. Like yeah, what, yeah. Like, it's, what, it's, what it's, D- it's DNA, with. right? When you okay, divert yourself it, from your it. true DNA, it just becomes yeah. trash. Yeah. Okay. All right. Jeez, I see that. Who? I don't know. If that's the right of analogy. But... No, I think so. I think he's right. <laughs> <laughs> no, you go. You go from like a. You go from like a virtual reality. Like you're stuck in. If you die, you die in real life. Like atmosphere to, is like. Uh, I, oh, I, I, don't respond. Oh, I, I don't disagree with that. I just meant like your DNA analogy. That's kind of kind of. No, 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 no. Yeah, because this isn't up, like like this isn't what Sword Art was mainly about in the beginning. This yeah. isn't what drew well, people. In. Well, yeah, yeah, like because he end he he the first season he wrote when he was fifteen, and then for some reason he didn't end it. He just he just made a new game. So. But you think he would like? You think he would like? You know, get better. <laughs> Right. He's, probably, he's probably like scared. He was he was too scared to risk like, uh, to risk messing with his original story. Well, the thing that sucks though, like at this point now, like, like and how like you know like we mentioned before, like and like how David you said, where it's just like at the, at this point, it's like only fans of Sword Art that are really watching it. Like the casual yeah. fans are really just kind of passed by it or just don't yeah. care. Mm-hmm. Um, so I think it's at the point now, like, because it's like because all the hype was for this season. Where actually I don't like the first part of uh of alicization i don't think i had that many like really big issues with it i mean there was like ones here and there 
But yeah, for no. some reason, like the second season, just a clusterfuck of garbage. Yeah. And I just, I, I just didn't. I, I was like, was this how bad the first season of this was too? For Alex's the first season was that bad, but okay. but now that you mentioned it, like I realize like there's not as much hype even for like the Sword Art fans. I don't like see the hype around you know the new Sword Art like there usually is. Oh man, like still though, if you go if you go back to like, Reddit, like, there, ugh. Reddit, people usually like, post like clips and stuff, or even fan art. But I've yeah. not, I've heard, not really heard much about Sword Art this season. So, no, oh, I mean, I just looked, at, I, I just looked at Reddit that one day where I was just like that one day that we really went hard on Sword Art, where I'm just like, dude, this is shit. Like, and that's when I actually <laughs> looked to see like what people were saying, and everybody's like, oh man, this is as good as a light novel. I'm thinking, oh god, this <laughs> shows a lost cause. And get out, same- just yeah. get out. Yep.